Detroit Theater invites you inside a 30-story school where all 30. sorts of 30. I know. Wow. It's crazy. <laughs> and all sorts of funny things happen in their production of Sideways Stories from Wayside School. The show opens soon at Walton Art Center's Nadine Baum Studios. Here to tell us more, we've got Jake, we've got Chris. Thank you guys for joining Thanks us. Thanks for having me. Thanks. Really appreciate it. Yeah. So, first of all, let's talk about Trike Theater. What you do, what you do in our community. Tell us. Yeah, about sure. This. So, at Trike Theater, uh, we work with young artists. We uh, have classes, camps, workshops. We go out into the school. We do professional developments. Basically, our mission is to, you know, build character, cultivate creativity, and strengthen communities here in Northwest Arkansas. Yeah. yeah. And we're doing that by bringing exceptional theater experiences to the people, like Sideways Stories from Wayside School. I love it. Now, Jake, you are in the show, but I do. I have to show this photo no. of uh -oh. you <laughs> from 2009. It's a show to, photo of you and I working together. Yeah. Uh, we did a performance a bit. <laughs> Right, right in the middle, you were the star of our little. Uh, do you remember this? I 100% remember it. Well, I'm, I'm wearing the same. I'm wearing black shirt and jeans. I'm wearing the same outfit that I wore 10 years ago. Yeah, nostalgia. Yes, I love it. You brought it back. You knew I was going to show that photo, didn't you? I didn't, but I didn't know what right. photo. Yeah, <laughs> you were you were Max in. Um, and what, where the wild things where are. Where the wild things are. That's right. And my daughter Pippi. I mean, she really was. A, you had a baby face, and she was actually I had a baby. A baby child face. Yes. So tell us about your character in the show. Myron is uh, one of the students at Wayside School. Yeah. He, uh, gosh darn it, he has the best of intentions, but uh, <laughs> <laughs> you know, he so, does. Yeah, Myron, you know, I, Myron, I think rep represents so many young kids in their school experiences where they're trying real hard, yeah. and sometimes things work out for Myron. A right. lot of times, things don't work out for Myron. Yeah. I got yeah. you. you know. well, what can audiences expect from just the show in general? I, a lot of fun. Yeah. A lot of fun. So we're, you know, I, I hope a lot of people are familiar with uh, Lewis Sacker's books. Uh -huh. And uh, we've tried to bring the wackiness and the craziness of that to life on the stage. Uh, we've set it in the 1970s when the books were written. Yes. So for all of the parents and grandparents out there coming to see the show, You'll, uh, you'll definitely have some memory lanes to walk down. And I, I feel like we're on the same wavelength right now because you're in the show. I've worked with you. I just directed Holes, which was also a yeah, Lewis Sacker yeah, absolutely. Uh, book. So yeah. all the creative things are happening around Lewis Sacker in Northwest Arkansas. Well, right as now. it should be. He's yeah. a fantastic <laughs> a lovely writer. Author. Yeah. Yeah, so tell us when and where is the event happening? I know there are a few public performances. Sure. Right? We have public performances. They'll be at the Nadine Baum uh, Studios. And they are, we opened this Saturday, there we go, 7th, 14th, and 21st. Okay. You can uh, go to our website for specific times on specific days. But yeah, we have lots of opportunities for folks to bring their families out to see this fantastic production. And I do know they're okay. doing several uh, kids' performances as well for students in schools. So we if are. your child is going to see it, make sure to have a conversation with them about the book and about the play. Now, guys, before you go, yes. I know that there's a big fundraiser coming up for Trike that Theater. We want to do something exciting here on the show today. Yes, right? we do. We have our Laughter and Libations fundraiser coming yes. up. It is so much fun. It's Mardi Gras themed. It is March 13th at 7 p.m. Mm -hmm. at The Record uh, in downtown Bentonville. It's a fun night. Uh, we have comedians. We have uh, lots of different activities, great food, uh, lots of things to drink. And yeah. we still have tickets available if That's you right. are looking for them. And speaking of tickets, we're going to give away some tickets. If you want oh, to nice. head over to our Facebook page right now, you can enter for your chance to win tickets to the event, see comedian Raj Suresh. It should be a very fun night. So yeah. thank you. Looking forward to it for sure. Yeah. Thank you. We're Absolutely. really looking forward to it. As as well. Yes. Well, thanks also for coming on the show. Thanks Great fun. <laughs> I can't wait for people to see this show. It's good stuff.